is so much more eloquent than any words. It can tell and explain what feelings are, what we share. It says to you, I'm not alone. The Scent of a Music is a once-in-a-generation opportunity to really transform access and engagement in great music. The Scent of a Music will be truly equipped for a digital age where the orchestra can sound at its very best. It will draw people in in an accessible and welcoming way to an extraordinary wealth of music. People say, we have concert halls, we have places in which we can play music. But the idea that we would have a new place, it's not only for now, it's for the far, far future. We wanted to make a building that welcomes all people, whether you have a ticket for the concert or not. The hall actually is lifted off the ground. It liberates the ground uh, for the public, the general public to flow through and for continuous programming to happen day and night. We have the world's greatest acoustician making something which will finally be able to really surround people with the sound. Above that is another component, which are the commercial floors, and above that is a very special place at the very top that we call the Coda, and this is a space for alternative music that is a beacon at night, and it's a real hub. It's very, very important to have this sense of connectivity, spatially, physically, optically, in every way. Through the wonderful connectivity that the Millennium Bridge provided to Tate Modern, that actually connects very directly to what we want to achieve. And what Centre for Music will do is provide the welcome point into what we are calling Culture Mile. And it will be an international destination for arts, learning and culture. We don't want to build something that's just in a silo, that's only there for the privileged. We want to make music available to the widest possible community, not just across London, but beyond. The music education offer is crucial to this being a centre for music and not just a concert hall. And so the Guildhall School is a partner in it because of this. This hopefully will be really a new beacon for music, not only in London, but for the whole country. Another sign of London as a resurgent cultural city, which is something we're going to need, I think, more and more. And it's also saying we place music absolutely at the center of a city and the center of communities, way into the future.